Good morning, how are you? <laughs> it's an absolutely gorgeous day today. Look at it, it's just fabulous. The sun's come out and everything. Um, and it, it is apparently a heady 10 degrees today. I know, it's absolutely scorching. Uh, so here I am to make the most of it. I am back in North Lincolnshire and I am gonna do a little section of the Viking Way. Uh, I've started in Barnetby where I left off last time and I'm going to head towards Caister. Uh, I'm not sure I'm going to get all the way to Caister. I might um, maybe like stop at Grasby and then like circle back or might go all the way to Caister which is eight miles from here and then I'm going to have to loop back because I need to get back to Barnetby you see. Uh, so I'm just going to go with the flow, see how I feel. Um, yeah and just really make the most of it. Look at it, it's beautiful today. <laughs> So that was Bigby. Very nice indeed. It's clearly a place you go to live in if you have lots of money because there's some very nice, big, tidy houses in Bigby. Uh, yes, lovely place. Uh, now I'm just following this little track. I found some, found some furry friends. <laughs> it's clouding over a little bit, unfortunately. I call her. Sheep are now like urinating in my presence. That's very nice, isn't it? It's rather rude, I think. Um, so apparently there's a monument around here somewhere. And um, there's also a trig point at Bigby. There's Bigby Top. So I'm not sure if I'm going to investigate or not. I don't know. I might, I might do. It seems a shame if you go past the trig point not to go and find it. But it seems like a missed opportunity. So I... I might have a look um, but yeah it's quite a lovely walk so far really uh, enjoying it yeah it's been good on second thoughts i've decided not to go and investigate bigby top because i've just come across like a load of barbed wire so they obviously don't want you to go up that way so I'm not going to bother. I shall just carry on. There is a monument to investigate, so I'm going to go and have a look at that instead. Well, I have to say that is a very fine monument. It is very well looked after. Look at that gravel. It's perfect. Absolutely perfect. Uh, I'm not totally sure what it's for. Um, I maybe should have looked that up, I don't know, but it's very fine. Um, now that's a uh, summer bee down there. You can see that's also full of very grand houses. Uh, so this is obviously the place to go if you've got a bit of money in the bank. Uh, very nice indeed. Uh, this is the first time I've walked um, this section of the Viking Way. I've done a uh, Barton to Barnetby a few times uh, because it's quite easy uh, to get there. I think I've got a fly on my face. It's quite easy to get there uh, using public transport. Uh, but once you sort of like leave North Lincolnshire and get into Lincolnshire proper, um, public transport seems to sort of like steadily dry up. Um, so I've never done this section before. 
Um, so this is all new to me and I have to say it really is nice. I mean the views are looking marvellous, absolutely marvellous. Um, yeah, and, and clearly I found where all the posh people live. I mean I grew up on a council estate in Scunthorpe. <laughs> this is where all the posh people went. Uh, but yeah, I'm quite enjoying it so far. Very nice indeed. We're just approaching Sirby now, or Sirby, I'm not too sure how you say it, uh, but look at that house there. That's another beauty, isn't it? So I think, uh, yeah, this is going to be another gorgeous little village uh, that I've never been to before. Uh, I'm going to find somewhere to go and eat my lunch because I'm getting hungry now, but I think there's a church over there, so I might go and maybe sit in the grounds there. Is that the world's oldest bus stop? Because that's what it looks like. I mean, how old is that? Can't be, surely. What is it? It says 1866. What does it say? Something... Rest and be thankful, I think. It's got a little cross on there. Oh, that's interesting, isn't it? What is it? They obviously didn't have buses in 1866, so I <laughs> wonder what that is. It's just opposite the church, so I'm going to go and find uh, somewhere to sit now and have my lunch. Now, I've got a book for the Viking Way. It's not in print anymore. I found this on eBay. Um, and it's quite a canny little book um, uh, and apparently the monument uh, at uh, Summerby is uh, for somebody called Sir Edward Weston who was an 18th century politician. He's buried somewhere in Summerby churchyard. So there you go. I thought I'd have a look in here to see if I could find out what that um, structure is by the church, that little resting spot, but it doesn't seem to have anything in. Uh, but I might go and have a little look inside the church now, because that looks quite nice. So that was CB. Very nice, very peaceful. Uh, I did go into the church, but there was a bloody YouTuber in there filming it. Would you believe? <laughs> you can't escape them, can you? <laughs> uh, so yeah, it looked like a gorgeous little place. Uh, it's not. I don't often go into these little churches, and I should do more often because uh, some of them are quite beautiful and have all sorts of history associated with them.
so the next little village that we come across on here is a little place called Owlby. Owlby? I don't know how to pronounce it. It's spelt O-W-M-B-Y. So if anybody knows how it's pronounced, please let me know because I am clueless. Um, and obviously all these little uh, villages along the Viking Way were once uh, Danish settlements. Um, as you can tell because they all end in B. Um, yeah, so after this one, the next one's going to be Grasby. made it to Grasby. Unfortunately the church seems to be closed which is a shame because it just looks beautiful. I mean look just how old the door is. <laughs> I imagine it's gorgeous inside. Um, so I think what I might do is kind of like uh, end my walk here really and I'm gonna like double back now because uh, I think I've done about, I think, let me just check, uh, oh just over five and a half miles from Barnetby. Uh, so yeah, I think what I'm gonna do, I'm going to now like basically just turn about and like I'm gonna retrace my, st my steps and go all the way back to Barnetby uh, following the Viking Way. It has been an absolutely gorgeous walk. I've really loved it. Um, so originally I was thinking I could do like a circular walk. I'd like walk along the, Viking Way and then I'd like take some other footpaths and like circle my way back to Barnetby from Grasby or potentially uh, Caister uh, but I think I'm gonna just like stop here now and I'm just actually just gonna double back because it is really gorgeous um, so I'm gonna do that today and then I think another day I will come back uh, probably park up at Grasby and then uh, do sort of the same again through Caister and yeah and just like either turn it into a circular or just like a there and back and that might be the way I do the Viking way um, just uh, through a series of day walks uh, using the car uh, rather than trying to use public transport because it's just yeah I think it's just it's almost impossible really um, and especially around these villages it's just yeah it's just you can't <laughs> you just can't do it um so yeah it's been absolutely gorgeous today i've really loved it uh so i'm going to probably end my filming here today uh i will say goodbye uh thank you for watching and i'll see you next time <laughs>